So I am currently just in where am I? Singapore. Um, I'm full so day is going to come so tired but it's actually Tasia's well, birthday a few days ago and we decided to go to Bangkok but I had to get a plane from London to Singapore which I'm now I missed my connecting flight so then I had to book a whole new flight but yeah I'm here now anyway but we're just not going to dwell on the madness so I've literally was just in a lounge but I want to show you I've been to Singapore before have I? Yeah, I've been to Singapore before but the airport is so beautiful let me show you like this is the airport here like it's actually much more beautiful than this this is just the main bit where the shops are and the food hall look how beautiful like they have all of this in the airport like it's just so mad like no this, this, is, this is I'm not even at the main terminal but like look at these fish I'm not sure what these are called but these are definitely some kind of rare fish Like, so beautiful. Oh, hell no. Oh my God. This is so mad. I've been traveling since Sunday night, 9 p.m. It's now Tuesday, going in, going into Tuesday morning I'm in Bangkok. Like, I'm so tired. Like, I'm gonna try and get up tomorrow and do like a little fitness routine, but let me give you a room tour actually. So this is like, not our main hotel we're staying in, but this is like a Bangkok hotel. Tasia actually booked it like, so last minute. It's so cute. Like, she got a room upgrade. Like, how cute is this? Oh my god, this. Oh, I don't like the shadow there though. <gasps> but it's actually so cute. Luggage has done my. The bed. And there's also like. It's actually so big. Like. No. Tej actually hooked this room up. Tej actually hooked this room up. It's my first day in Bangkok with Tej. Um, it's actually mad I've been here before, but it's, I can tell it's gonna be so hot, but like, oh, I can't tell, I just woke up fresh, sleep in the eye, everything. Um, let me show you the view. It's a pool down there, and the cleaning up pool. Like, it reminds me a lot of Hong Kong. And this reminds me of Miami because the buildings. It's so cute. Okay, I'm just gonna get ready to go for breakfast. I'm not gonna bother waking up Tasia because she's probably wanting to sleep in and stuff. The spot is really annoying me. Um, then I'm gonna try and go breakfast, go gym. Then me and Tasia can wake up to try and do something. Just going for breakfast. The breakfast looks so nice. Let's get some of the breakfast now. Looks so cute. Morning, morning. Hello, hi. Guys, I'm gonna show you breakfast. So here's all the juices. And they have a salad bar. Like, how cute is breakfast? And there's like the chef there, and it's like. They've got like Yakult and stuff. It's so cute. They have everything from like Thai to English eggs. Okay, this is like everything I got for breakfast. So I got bacon, egg, sausage, omelette, California roll, um, coffee, 
Danish blueberry. Um, these are kind of like, I think like Cheerios, and I got me some juice. Guys, I actually chowed down. Breakfast was so nice. Um, I would say I wish the food was a bit warmer though. Um, I'm not sure if Tasha's woken up yet, but I was trying to think, is this tank too cute to wear to the gym? I just don't know, like, I'm not sure if I'm gonna wear it while I'm here, but it is Charles Loverboy. Hmm, I can always get dry clean, but I feel like it is a tiny bit unflattering. Ciao. But yeah, I might just wear this to the gym. Um, I'm going to try and do like a cute little workout. Quick little bush bush. And then Mintasia, hopefully, we'll do something because the sun's coming out, but does that ass look fat? Mm hmm. Mm. I'm so proud of myself. I literally did a workout. Um, I didn't do too much. I probably did about 40 minutes, but that will have to do. But I need to get some protein shakes while I'm here, just so. It's a bit easier, but um, I don't, oh, you know what's annoying here? So, they weigh like your hand luggage, like in the UK, I don't feel like they weigh your hand luggage. Like I've never had my hand luggage weighed, like you have to bring hand luggage on, I think they just do it by size, it's so weird. So, the hours I've taken to get here is just so crazy. Um, But the gym was really small, like in which I'm quite surprised that like, they definitely have the space for like, why is there not, why is there no running machines? Like, for such a big hotel, I think I remember this last time when I came to Bangkok, like, for such a big hotel that have such a small, like, have you got, only got one bench? Like, there's, there's like 18 floors. Imagine if everyone wants to go to the gym at the same time. Maybe it's kind of like um, San Francisco where like, people here go to a gym and get a pass mate more than um, go into hotel gyms. I might even, that would be quite a shout, but I actually couldn't be asked to even buy a day pass. I'll just use the gym here, like, I ain't got time. Um, Tasia woke up, but I'm not sure she's probably gone back to sleep. I'm actually really sleepy, that's why I just thought, you know what, Gary, do what you can. And then, yeah, so, um, oh, my skin is actually really playing. Um, look at this view, though. This view is actually insane. I'm actually working, I would love to live in, like, a proper, like, city, like, New York. I'm not sure. I don't think I could live in Thailand. I just feel like, um, I just feel like culturally, it's it's a huge shock. Like, I don't know. I feel like, mm, to be fair, everyone does speak English. But I'm not sure though. I feel like, mm, to be fair though, there is a lot of expats here. I'm not, I'm not sure. I, th I think I would like, I think I could live here maybe for like a year. It depends. I would have to have like a job. I wonder what the, wonder what influencer content creators are like out here. Is there even a scene? Wait, it's probably a bit more bigger in, I don't know. Like, I'd probably say like Hong Kong. Like, I don't know. I... This is my outfit for today. Um, you know what, because basically I was trying on outfits and I was like, I'm not sure what to wear. Like, I had this outfit, which I actually bought this for, what up? I think I bought this for Barcelona actually. Did I? Uh, Barcelona or Miami, I didn't end up wearing it, but it's so, Nice, it's like a cute little. I want to take it off, I can be like, Did I kill the queen? And the queen got the wrist, don't go. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so Taylor's basically ready in three minutes. One well, thing about me, baby, I'm gonna be old up, so I'm gonna use this Vaseline gel. We're gonna go get some coffee. Um, imagine, yeah, you know, with the hotel, imagine if you lose this little hotel key here. It's, it's 200 baht, which is like, I think it's like maybe five pounds. Like, everyone loses their hotel key at once in their flipping stay. So it's just so annoying. 
Like, what in the... Is that a luxury service? I haven't got any makeup on. I've got these cute little vintage Chanel shades I forgot I had. I'm bringing my camera. I'm bringing my big camera to do... A, I might do a, my outfit's not anything amazing, but I might just do a picture just so the girlies know. This I'm going to see if I can get some... Like, it's just so... Ugh, anyway, but, yeah. I'm going to see if I can get some skincare out here because they're really known well for the SPS, but... How cute. Let me try and clean. We had KFC. Oh my god, the KFC here is so good. <laughs> like, the KFC is so good. Listen, the KFC got murdered down. So, yeah, clean this out. Then, yeah. Look who's here. Tasha has finally joined the vlog, guys. <laughs> finally in the video. We cannot believe we're in Thailand. For her birthday. Right around, right around <laughs> getting dirty. <laughs> uh, how's it supposed to be in Thailand? Good. I'm happy to be here. The weather is giving. Yeah, the weather's so Gary nice. Gary has finally arrived. I know, guys. When I was looking at yesterday, I was, I was literally almost trapped for 24 hours. Did you vlog it all? No, I didn't vlog it. I was oh, just right. You never vlogged the madness? I know, I should have vlogged it. It was, guys, I have to tell you about the madness of me traveling yesterday. It was too much. But we just had, we, what did we have? No, we had a Starbucks. We just chilled at some cafe and now we're en route to the store house of Bangkok. So, yeah. Super excited to see what that's like. Hopefully, it'll be like super different. Mm. It'll be cute. So much seafood. Oh my god, wait. Like, look at the crab. Hey, <laughs> he's doing his little dancey dance. <laughs> he's doing his little dancey dance. So, so Tasha's about to get um, a sort of fish, fish fillet is looking. The, the, yeah, the rain's coming down a bit, guys, but the market is so cool. But, I need to get a case. Do you want to get a case? <laughs> Do I need it? Yeah, take guys. Tasha, Tasha's um, brought back in. Sorry, whoops, sorry. Brought back in a case. She doesn't got a case in. Do you have a, I don't know what this is. You need to have a Do you want a cash point? So we're just heading to the cash point. Yeah, if you're gonna come to this market, guys, it's called. I'll put the name below. But you're there for wow. These frames are so cute. Nice. These are so nice. Guys, is this market? So, guys, I'm about to try. This is the. Uh, what's it called? It's called Zeng Lab, and it's their famous sweet fruit for bone food. Look at it! So I'm in Singapore. Oh, I'm in I'm at Bangkok, and I'm about to try their Zeng Lab. So this is their famous pork. It's like in a soup broth, but I also got a coconut. I'm gonna try the coconut first. Really good, the coconut is too good, too good. Yeah. 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 Hold on, are you ready now? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's try that. Let's try the soup. Ooh. Wow. Wow, this is so spicy. Um, it's so crazy like guys that the street just goes on for so flipping long like it's like it's probably the biggest Chinatown we 
have ever, ever seen. Like, I'm actually just so rocked. Like, oh my God. <laughs> Paige is gonna cover herself some Chanel sandals. <laughs> Um, I didn't bring my camera out today, but we, no, tonight, later on tonight, um, we went to, where did we go to? We went to the market, which you probably last saw. We came back, grabbed some food, and went to see a ping pong show. It was awful, guys. It was actually awful. I, mean, I, mean, like, I came to Bangkok maybe about 10 years ago, and it was really good, but maybe the girls are just tired after covid after um, the pandemic, the girls are just tired, so I'm so drained now. It's like, what's weird, it's like 8 o'clock in the UK, but it's like 4 o'clock in the morning here. Jet lag is really going to beat my ass. This is like, tomorrow's our last day in this hotel, so then we go to Phuket, which we actually need to book because we haven't booked our flights. Oh, my skin looks so glowy though. I cannot wait. I feel like I haven't had any sun, but Bangkok's very much a city place, but I'm going to go to bed now. Because I'm knackered. I'm going to miss this room. These rooms are so nice and big. Um, they're just so nice. I feel like I'm still so tired, but I don't want to waste any days being in bed. Um, I woke up pretty early this morning for breakfast in the gym. I'm, I want to try and go gym tomorrow and the day after, but it depends what time my flight is. I'm not sure what time how much flights are. Hmm. Morning? Well, it's not even morning. It's like four o'clock. Oh my God, we've been trying to book our flights back and like, we've got to forget tomorrow, but why did we leave... Such last minute to book our flight tomorrow. I can't even book a flight back to. Um, why is this break? Why is this necklace? Oh, back to. Um, I can't book my flight. I wanted back from Phuket to Singapore because the flight sold out. Because this is what happened. This is one of my new new resolutions was to stop waiting so long and now it's booked up. So either flight six get there for nine with a risk of missing me missing my flight, or get there for two. But you know what? It's fine. Oh, this. Don't much really get on my nerves, but it's what I'm wearing today. Are these too tight though? I think they're a bit tight, but it's fine. The teacher should be waiting for me downstairs. Um, I think it might be my Jodie actually. Oof. I feel a bit rough today, guys. I feel a tiny bit rough. So we are outside. We literally just ate, and now we're en route to the temple. It's actually our last day in Bangkok because we go to Phuket tomorrow, which we're so excited about, but we're gonna <laughs> We're on another tuk-tuk. We're on a tuk-tuk. Honestly, if you come to Bangkok, get a tuk-tuk. Like, it's such an experience. Like, all the girls are on tuk-tuks. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah! Why is she on the floor? No! That just hit the face. Like, and she's always thinking of at least let us sit down. <laughs> <laughs> so rude. Oh, I'm working on the tuk-tuk. I'm super popular, but we're just out here in traffic. Like, guys, we ride in dirty. Period. Period. So me and Tasia have finally arrived at seeing the Buddha. So we went to go and see it first and the, dri the driver, <laughs> he basically mudded us off guys. He drops us at some, the Buddha was way smaller. There wasn't one. Oh yeah, there wasn't one. It was just a temple. <laughs> it was just a temple, but let me show you how big this is. Like I'm actually sweating because it's so hot, but this is how big it is. Like you can even see, but like I feel like the camera doesn't do it justice. Like it is, it's probably one of the biggest artifacts I've ever seen in my life like like look how big it is in my head I'm thinking if this was to suddenly fall now me and Tasia wouldn't even have time to run because the impact oh let me show them how big it is let me run in front actually you run in front <laughs> so now you can see guys how big this it's is so this is Gary he's gonna go all the way to the end <laughs> okay he's a dot and then I'm gonna show you how big it is. 
insane. It's crazy. It's so big. It's so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> it's so big, guys. Like, but it's so peaceful here and so quiet. I wonder how they clean it. Though it looks dusty, a bit dusty in it. They do it. I don't know how I they don't clean even it. Know how they built this. It's just, it's actually terrible. Oh so my god! Do you know what's, you know what's a bit scary about it's it? The eyes. It's the eyes. Yeah. I can't look cool because you know I'm already chicken. Guys, Tasha staying in Bangkok for a new man. <laughs> You doing? Yeah. <laughs> then number one. I think you kick a number. Yeah, number. <laughs> I've forgotten numerology. Okay. Today was such a fun day. Like, Bangkok is so beautiful, but we leave tomorrow. But I would actually come back here. I'd actually come back to Bangkok. Um, the only thing I will say is that what kind of made our night go to Liverpool. We ended with some massages. Massages here are super affordable. Where's my lotion? Um, oh, there it is. Um, but. Guys, there's actually so many cockroaches here, which I actually remember um, when I last came here. Like, so I think it's under, like, it's just gonna happen because it's a city, humid, the heat's mad. So yeah, but I would definitely recommend coming here. I'm gonna go to sleep now because we've gotta be up at 6.30 to leave for 7.30 for our flight to free. <sighs> 7.27, I'm so fucking tired. Like, this camera's making me look so weird, but yeah, I had two hours sleep, so we're gonna be pretty tired today. Um, after Phuket, super exciting. Everyone's awake. My suitcase is definitely slackless. I can't find my sock anywhere. Okay, let's get ready to go. We are in Phuket. I keep saying Bangkok, but we're probably in Phuket. It is so hot. Looking busted. So, hey. Busted. We're running on two hours of sleep. Two hours. Who can? It just feels like literally ten times. Well, I would say about forty times hotter than Bangkok because there's more sun here. As we just arrived, getting our welcome drink. Is we literally just checked into our room and it is so nice like this is a glamping style i'm gonna put all the information about the hotel below because it's such an interesting concept because when i think of glamping i don't think of this like it's actually like the room is so nice the bed's really comfy um the views are really nice literally we can walk to the beach in less than 20 flipping seconds and like the lighting like oh, even to take pictures and stuff like it's giving me like mexico vibes like even though even with Uphaket, this reminds me i feel i've never been to mexico like tulum but i can imagine this is what a tulum resort would look like it's so nice but look at the view outside it's so beautiful it's so but well, it is super hot outside i'm not gonna lie like it's so hot but it's so beautiful and it's interesting to see like how different this is from like bangkok obviously bangkok's a city but like even just the vibe here and like the relaxedness of it like it's not as like cha like chaotic so guys i'm literally just at the beach club it is so relaxing here oh my god Tasia's just literally chilling by the beach club like okay, it is beautiful like it's so Actually in um I just got to Phuket, it's so nice. Um as if they asked me to go to the Friary, that's so crazy. The Friary was just so mad. Like I feel like the Friary was just such weird but I wonder how Jack is. I feel like I heard Jack got married and he's got like a few kids now. Um I'm not sure what's going on. <laughs>
<laughs> so we just saw a pink punk. <laughs> we just saw a pink punk show. It was like it was actually better than the one we saw before. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was offering me though. <laughs> we're, just, we're just trying to get a toilet before we go home, but guys, it's so hot. It's hot in it. Yeah, I need to. Let's see, when you go to Burger King. Okay, guys. Oh shit, there's a lot of people awake. I'm gonna see if I can see the sunrise. Wow, it's so beautiful. Why is my camera so steamy? It's like 6 30 at walk up because I want to see the sunrise. Look how beautiful it is. There's one woman on the beach though. Wow. Look how beautiful the sky looks. Oh my god. I feel like short time on, on my phone it said the sunrise is gonna happen at about 6.42. I'm actually a bit confused, like, when's it happening? I'm so tired. My skin looks really cute though. I think the sunrise is happening because the, the, um, the sky is going like this weird pink, it almost looks like a sunset, but it's a sunrise. The clouds like, it's very much giving Katy Perry, California Dream, but a song. California. What I like about staying here as well, um, there's not loads of people on the beach because it's a beach club slash glamping, so they haven't got a lot of room, so there's only a select few people here. Just had breakfast, it was so freaking nice. I didn't even vlog it, but the breakfast here is amazing. I would, I would 100% stay here again. I think it's a really good hotel if you want to stay at other places. Like, um, I probably wouldn't stay here for like, my whole duration because it's such a different vibe and I feel like it's so nice for like one to three days. Like, you've got the beach club, you've got music, you've got the vibes, it's so flipping nice. Um, Tayshia's still out having breakfast and we're literally just getting ready. What's quite cool is, so these are the blinds here. So when you go to sleep, you literally black them down like this and there's no insects in here, which I'm really, really happy about. I did even do a room tour. Oh, the room's a mess. I'm not sure how I would even do it, but like, it's actually so flipping cool. I should have done a room tour really, but let me show you the bathroom. Um, yeah, that's the bathroom. It's a bit of a mess, but everything kind of gets blacked out. So flipping nice. Oh God. So our car's going to pick us up at, um, I can't wait to pick us up at 12.15, so we just gotta like, make sure we get ready. So we've got enough time, to be honest. Um, just making sure I charge all my cameras. Um, I think we're gonna try and go to this cafe today that was known for the um, like drone footage. I wonder what I would wear for that, though. Hmm. So we just arrived at our brand new uh, hotel we're checking into. This is a Twin Palms, and it is so nice. Like, it's completely different to where we was. It's like dark, moody, Kind of brownish like let me show you the pool so this is the pool and look at it it's so beautiful and it's so quiet here like and then this is the whole reception area it's so beautiful like i'm literally in love with this aesthetic got tasia there <laughs> it's so nice here Guys, so we got into the room and Tasia's birthday surprise here. They decorated the room so nice. Like, it's actually so nice. How do you feel, Tasia? I feel good. I feel relaxed and sweaty. <laughs> you were outside, so I'm bathing. There's a little cake. Oh. Cake, 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 cake. I know
officially en route to the PP Islands. Hey, it's morning, Tasia. <laughs> we have to get up so early, and oh my god, like there is so much people. But obviously, it's part of the experience. But we're literally just walking down to our boat now, so I think. Don't we have you get separate wristbands and whichever colour you are, you are integrated into the group. So let me show you the walk where we're going down now. Just down here, I'm making our way down. It is so fucking hot today, but I'm so excited. Fuck this club, fuck this, fuck this club, fuck this club, fuck this, fuck this club, fuck. Fuck this club up, fuck this, fuck this club up, fuck this club up, fuck this, fuck this hey, club yo. up. Tell them that I'm the sleaze, they telling me, okay, prove it I lead these bitches on red, so now they know that they do it I tell them I'm moving units, my videos, they gon' do it Spotify ain't got a lot, they really streaming my music I get bitches the kind, they fuck around and lose it, nah I am no way, but only way when I'm telling them bye Bitch, we ain't ten and eight returner or identical When I'm around, bitch, you know you be cutting this about Guys, we're just landing on the last island. It looks so nice. Everyone on the beach on the boat was actually falling asleep because it's honestly just so hot and like the boat is just so giddy. But we're on the last island now. We've got here quite hour and 40 minutes. I'm not even sure what this island's called. It's called Pai My, My Beach. The cat is so beautiful. Like we've got deck chairs here if you want to chill. This is like all the locals. So yeah, there's deck chairs. Cocktail bars, everything. People are doing pictures. It's quite nice if you want a sunbathe. Oh. Let's see what here is. Two chairs, one fifty. Okay, how much? What's this island called? What's it? What's it called? It's, it's called Kai Nai Island, guys. It's so nice. It's so beautiful. So I'm gonna wait for Tasia to come off. We're gonna see what we want to do. Get us to go over to the beach. Say hey, Tasia. <laughs> we're just on the beach. We don't know what this island's called, but we're relaxing. We're sitting down. It's our last stop before we go to. I keep, I keep wanting to say Bangkok, but we're going back to Phuket. So relaxing, guys. So we have finally got to the last part of our hotel. This is our third hotel we're in. This day just say hey. Looking on glowy and dewy. Um. <laughs> so we're gonna talk guys, this hotel is good. It's called the Twin Palm. I told the how you say it's got like a Z in it. it's called I'll put it on screen. It's called um is it Mazan Maz oh. 
Mon Montezur Montezur. It's so beautiful. And I feel like each hotel we've been in's given us like a different vibe. This is giving me like it's just very modern, contemporary, beautiful, also different kind of tones. We have a kitchen here, guys. They literally have a milk frother. Li they literally have a milk frother. We should look at us have a little mini oatly. <laughs> They've got um, the fridge. This is the living room. Our stuff's already there. Now I had to like live in. Also, it's a smart TV so we can like stream YouTube, Netflix, and we also have a balcony. Let me show you the balcony. Uh, I need to show you the pool also because it's so ooh, gorge. And then it's our balcony. And that's the pool. How beautiful is it? That's a second pool actually. So beautiful. And me and Tasia were saying how like. There's so many picture moments here. Like for content, it's actually just perfection. Um, I'm gonna show you, this is our bedroom. Love the tones, we've got the twin beds. We also got another TV. We also have another balcony. Again, beautiful outside. I love the big trees. I feel like Thailand is so green, but this hotel in particular is probably the most greenest out of all of them because of the leaves, the palm trees. It's just, guys, and you guys know, I feel like, in our hotel, I feel like the whole, the bathroom is the biggest part of it. Like, it definitely makes or breaks the room. And this bathroom, first of all, I want to give them correction. The lighting is insane. It's so good. I feel like you have a, because it's white as well, it's reflecting off your face. So it's be really nice to do glam in here. Got water and we have this bathtub, which is actually, oh, it's like a shower bathtub as well. You've got also a shower head and a bath and it's like ceramic. Oh my God, it's so, it actually reminds me of another bath I've actually been in. We've got the toilet, which is separate, glass. It's so freaking beautiful. Like, and the sun bed's actually in water, it's so mad. The sun's gonna set about 6.30, which is so excited for, because the sun, like, the, honestly, the sunsets have been so red, so hopefully we get to see that from here. So vibey. We're just having a chill day today before our last couple of days here, but the weather today is actually so nice. I'm not sure because it's here, but it's hot more to be fair, we are shaded. I'm not sure because it's just warm without being too intense. So we're just here. The sunset's about half past six every single day, and every time me and Tasia have like missed the sunset, but the sunset here is so red. Like as it's going down now, I think as it gets closer to the sea, it's getting like like this really burnt orange color. It's so crazy. Let me show you. I'm not sure if you can see. It is our last day today in Thailand. We're in this room and oh my God, it's actually insane. So this is the penthouse sea view. Let me show it to you. Like how insane is this? So you have the kitchen, then you have this beautiful view here. Like how gorgeous is this? And then you have the bedroom. Like, how freaking insane. Like, it's just such goals. And guys, we actually have a private pool. Let me show you. Okay, I actually can't find my camera. Where is it? Like, the view. Look how beautiful it is. I can't find anything that connects to my camera. Where did I put that? Maybe it's upstairs. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to show you where to private pool. Like how insane. This is like so gorgeous. Like how nice is it? Why is my camera thing? I'm trying to think as my camera lens protector drops in the pool. 
This view is crazy. Like even just being here, like guys, Thailand is so beautiful. I'm at the, this is the Twin Palms Mont Azur. I have put it in this, on the screen, but it's so beautiful. So it's our last full day here, yeah, and we've made it to see the sunset. What's this temple called again? It's called the Big Buddha. Yeah, the Big Buddha. Let me show you the Buddha, because we're at the back, but that's what it looks like. I need to show you the front when we're going down. But look at the sunset. It looks so beautiful. So, so nice. I Thailand. Um, I'm going home in a few hours. I'm so tired. I um, literally just packed up my suitcases there. Um, today is a bit overcast actually, but I'm actually going to miss this view so much. Let me open the door. Like, look at this view. I'm going to miss it so freaking much. Yeah, I am so hot, all packed. Hoping my suitcases go through okay. I had to buy an extra suit, um, backpack because before I fly to London from Singapore, I have to check in another bag, so hopefully that goes okay. 